Robin Roberts explains her absence from GMA on Friday. George Stephanopoulos and Robin Roberts both skipped Good Morning America on Friday, and Roberts has explained why she didn't watch the program. Although devoted followers may have assumed it was simply an early start to Memorial Day weekend, Robin missed the performance for much more significant reasons. Robin was in this location on Friday instead of on Good Morning America. Both Robin Roberts and George Stephanopoulos were not present on Friday's episode of Good Morning America. They were replaced by White Johnson and Juju Chang, two well-known faces. As a result, Michael Strahan was the show's sole remaining main host. Many spectators believed they may have simply begun their weekend early because it was the Friday before Memorial Day weekend. While neither initially provided an explanation for their absence, Robin ultimately appeared on her Instagram account and shared her reason for skipping the program that day. It is true that Robin Roberts began her holiday weekend early and in vogue. She skipped GMA on Friday in order to get prepared for the Taylor Swift concert at MetLife Stadium in New Jersey that evening. On her Instagram stories, Robin published some images from the performance. A crowd was gathered behind Robin and a companion as they awaited Taylor Swift's entrance in the first picture. The timer for the concert was visible in the second image. Taylor Swift could be seen singing in the following several videos. The crowd was electrified as they watched the pop artist put on yet another fantastic performance, and it appeared as though Robin was having a great time at the event. Taylor Swift's world tour continues to be highly popular. This year's New Era's tour is attracting a lot of interest from fans. It has grown to be so popular that Ticketmaster had significant reaction when last year's on-sale date was a complete failure and scammers descended on the website to purchase up tickets and defraud the fans. Some Swift fans pointed the finger at her, but the singer is always one to defend her followers, and she did so once again in this case. Tickets for the two concerts she announced at MetLife Stadium in New Jersey sold out two days later. Swift's era's tour at the time sold more than two million tickets in the brief period after they went on sale. Funny anecdotes about parents asking the school to explain their children's absences from the performances started to circulate. In another instance, a principal issued a notice requesting that students not miss class in order to attend the performance.